is Brian Gibbons, and um, I want to just throw out an idea. If you are looking at trying to buy a rental and make some money, you might break even, um, and then you need to take care of maintenance and that kind of thing. So buying a rental isn't necessarily the best way to get started. Wholesaling is where you go out and get an option purchase agreement on a property, and then you sell that option for a couple thousand dollars. And that's not the easiest way to make money in real estate either. You can. I highly recommend you, if you're just starting, go out and bird dog. There's one other way. Right now, uh, the Wall Street Journal has basically said that there's a ton of properties out there that have no equity. No equity deals are either a subject to or a lease option. And what that means is the seller has a hard time selling. They can't afford to sell with an agent. Uh, they generally can't sell by FISBO, so they end up renting it out. Well, you can offer a rent-to-own solution or buy it on subject two and do a rental. Um, that's probably the cheapest way that I know how to get started in real estate investing. But you're more of a real estate entrepreneur. You're not really investing. You're flipping a, a, a lease option agreement or you're buying the property subject to existing financing. So those are two ways that you can make money uh, right now. There is issues with the subject too and you need to study that and be able to deal with the risks of the uh, due on sale clause, but I believe that they're manageable. Um, the lease option assignment, your, your goal is to find somebody that just missed financing and work with them to help them get a mortgage and we work with credit improvement specialists to help those people. So just a food for thought, seeing if you can think of other ideas if you don't have very much money to work with. And that's my answer to that question. Okay, thanks a lot.